The following video is sponsored by InstantMaddenCoins.com. The only place to get Madden Coins instantly on every console and platform is InstantMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again with another Madden 17 video. And guys, we're gonna be doing a challenge today based on the Denver Broncos and Kansas City Chiefs game that happened last night on Sunday Night Football. And that game, obviously guys, if you didn't watch it, there was a blowout in the favor of Kansas City. They took it to the Broncos. And one of the funniest things that happened in that game was actually that Dontari Poe, who's a defensive tackle, mind you, through a touchdown. Now, he threw it at the one-yard line, and it was when the game was completely out of control, but it was an embarrassing thing. It was one of those things where the Chiefs, I really feel like, were just trying to run up the score and embarrass the Broncos. The Broncos have had their number for a couple of years now, and the Chiefs are definitely taking that momentum in the 2016 season. So, they threw that touchdown pass with Don Terry Poe, and it kind of got my mind thinking. What would happen if Alex Smith went down, went down, all the other backups went down, and they had to go with Don Terry Poe as an emergency quarterback? And instead of being at the one-yard line, imagine if they had to be on the opposite side of the field at the one-yard line, their own one-yard line, and they had to drive 99 yards. Could they do it in one pass? Is that possible? We'll take a look today, guys. We're going to try and do it with Don Terry Poe. His attributes are absolutely horrendous. So let's take a look at those before we get into the video. Now, if you guys are interested, let's take a look at his attributes at quarterback. He is a 12 overall, ladies and gentlemen. 26 years old, 73 speed, which is actually faster than Nick Foles, hilariously enough. Does have the 97 strength. His acceleration is an 83. Now, the things that we really care about, obviously, let's get into them. The quarterback attributes, let's find him on here. There we go. Throw power, 25. 25 throw power. This dude's got worse throw power than like me. I swear, like he's got the same throw power as the kicker, worse throw power than the punter. And his throw accuracy is horrendous. Six for throw accuracy short, six for throw accuracy mid, and six for throw accuracy deep. Absolutely horrendous numbers. Those might be the worst numbers in the game. I haven't looked, but that is horseshit. Oh my goodness, dude. That is awful. So needless to say, obviously, Dontari Poe is not the guy that we want to have if we're trying to throw a 99-yard touchdown pass. But that's what's going to make this challenge really, really challenging. All right, guys. We are at the one-yard line. Going to give it a shot here with Dontari Poe at quarterback. Take a look at this beast, guys. He is freaking huge at the quarterback position. Like, that is just ridiculous. He looks like a freaking giant back there. So, I don't know. We'll see what we can do here and see if he's got the arm to get it down the field. I'm going to try a play-action pass on the first try here and see if we can make him go deep. Um, we've got a couple of fast guys on the field here at wide receiver. We do got Chris Conley. We've got Travis Kelsey. We might have to switch around the, uh, the lineup here just a little bit and see if we can get Tyreek Hill in there eventually if, if it's not working out for us. But for right now, let's see if we can beat him deep here. Oh, we got him, I think. Never mind. <laughs> Dude, that would have been a touchdown if he just had any bit of an arm. Like, that was ridiculous. He does not have an arm for this at all. This is not a good sign. All right, so let's try it again here. We're going to actually leave our running back and our fullback back in uh, protection to see if we can actually get better protection and see if we can get it a little bit deeper down the field. Although, I'm not sure if that's necessarily going to help out that much. Hit him, Poe. Hit him. Oh, Conley, you're terrible. Oh, oh, no. Okay, so we pulled Jeremy Macklin out because he's just not quite fast enough. He actually has decent speed in the standard game here. I think he's got like 92 speed. But the guy that we put in, Tyreek Hill, has 96 speed with really high acceleration as well. And I think the best way for us to do this is to actually just beat him on a streak route. And it's just going to kind of almost be like seeing if the receiver can catch it deep and break a tackle to get past this defense. The Broncos secondary, if you guys don't know, is actually the best secondary in the game. And we'll see if we can beat him here. Oh, oh, he did catch it at least that time so Tyree Kill at least got some hands okay so the streak doesn't really appear to be working so what I'm gonna try and do is go on a C route and see if we can get them out to the outside if they run man coverage and they don't have safety help over the top we might be able to make this happen 
Okay, so the safety coverage is there. But we still hit Tyreek Hill. Oh, is he gonna break it? No! He almost got that. That is a really close. That's the closest we've been so far. All right, let's try that one again, man. Let's try that one more time here. We got zone. Nope, that's man coverage again. And not a good throw. Not a good throw. Okay, so they're bringing the safeties up right now. Maybe we can try and beat them over the top here. We've got to have protection here, though. See if the safeties drop back into coverage. Either way, we're going to end up throwing it deep. But if the safeties don't drop back into coverage, it's possible we might be able to beat them deep here. I'm not sure, but we'll try it out. Harry Kill's got the opportunity to do it, man. And then if Con... I don't know. We'll see. Conley might be able to get him deep, too. Okay, they're blitzing everybody. Come on! One time, Hill! Oh my gosh, that throw was horrible! That throw was horrible! Back to the drawing board, guys. Back to the drawing board on that one. Oh, no. Okay, single coverage here. Oh, he came up with the catch, but he didn't quite break the tackle. That would have been amazing. I wonder if we can confuse him here and maybe beat him deep with a streak. I don't know. That's a possibility with the two C routes on the field. Ah, we got single. We've got single. Oh, Macklin. I feel like we have to hit him with the rat catch, even in situations like that, because we have to go for the touchdown, you know? So, like, going for an aggressive catch and getting tackled is not going to be helpful. So, we really have to go for it, man. This could be it. This could be it. Oh, and Poe overthrows him. Why? All right, come on. Try it again. You got this, Hill. And there you go. But you almost caught it. All right, so this is kind of an interesting setup here. It looks like they're going to be blitzing a bunch of guys. So we're going to set Travis Kelsey into protection. And then we're going to send Spencer Ware actually out on the wheel route and see if we can get him going that way. If they run man coverage here, we're going to have Spencer Ware against the safety. And it's possible we might be able to beat him beat that way if we've got the protection. I don't know if we're actually going to get the protection on this, but we'll, we'll try it out. So it looks like it's zone coverage, unfortunately. And we just get killed, man. Oh. Okay. Oh, intercepted again, damn it. So the one thing I've noticed about him so far is that he really puts a lot of air under the passes. Even when you gun them in there, he really just doesn't get them there quickly. So like that, that would have normally been a completion against most coverages and get with most quarterbacks. But with Dontari Poe, it just didn't work out at all. But this is looking interesting here. They're bringing the safeties back to the line. Maybe we can try and beat them deep again here. I'm not sure if it's going to happen, but we'll try it out. Let's leave Travis Kelsey again in to protect. Oh my gosh, we might have single coverage here again. Yep, we do. But then he sent that safety though. Damn it! And Don Terry Poe can't get the pass in an effective manner there. Damn it! All right, so they pulled the safety now over to the middle of the field. And they pulled another one down. So we'll set Travis Kelsey there again. And we'll see if we can maybe go deep here. I don't think we're going to probably have Spencer Ware open. So... Let's do it like that, and let's see if he, the safety is probably going to have to decide if he wants to go to the left or to the right. Either way, we're going to try and bomb it deep past him, so let's see if we can make it happen. So he's staying kind of in the middle, damn it. Oh, come on, Hill. Oh, and he gets beat deep. Gary gets beat on the, the pass anyway. Son of a bitch, man. I don't know if we're going to be able to do this, guys. Like, it's so hard. We maybe can do, like, a wide receiver screen, but I kind of think that's cheating. I kind of want to do it with, like, an actual pass, you know? Like, actually having to make the play, and we just get killed there in the backfield. Oh, my goodness. Don Terry Poe can't hold on to the ball at all. Okay, okay. So, they blitz that corner. Come on, Poe. Oh, you're so terrible. Why? They keep leaving off coverage right now, and it's really annoying because I want them to press. If they press, we might be able to just beat them deep. I don't know. But, like, right now, it's, it's been very, very difficult. We got single here. We've got single coverage. Come on, Hill. Oh! <gasps> Oh, he nearly caught that one. That would have been an amazing catch. Come on, guys. Get that protection. Okay, we got Spencer Ware on a linebacker. Break it. Oh, I tried to throw it to Spencer Ware, and somehow Tyreek Hill ended up catching it. That's how bad Dontari Poe is right now. All right, safety's coming down again. Send him in protection. Come on, boys. Come on, Hill. You got this. They're sending the house. Come on, Hill. One time, one time, one time, he beat him deep. Let's go. 99-yard touchdown, Dontari Po. Let's go.
what a play! That was freaking epic, dude! Oh my gosh, I can't believe that he beat him when the ball was in the air like that. Tyreek Hill is not that kind of a receiver, but it worked out. Don Tyree Poe put it on the money, man. So there you have it, guys. We are able to throw a 99-yard touchdown pass with Don Tari Poe. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this one. Hopefully, you got a kind of a kick out of it anyway with my reactions and things like that. If you guys enjoyed this type of content and you want to see more of it, be sure to drop a like on it below. Comment on the channel and let me know what kind of stuff that you guys want to see as far as like challenges and things like this in the future in the comment section below. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new, and I will talk to you guys again soon.